Yeah. You're still one of the veterans on the team. Some of the kids. Practice. What advice to give you quarterbacks in general? You know, I, you know, I'm, I'm, I, we haven't played a game. Neither of them have played a game yet. But I, I just tell them, you know, go out there and compete. And when we get closer to the game time, I'll, I'll probably have more, more stuff to tell them. But right now, it's just learn all you can. Just go be. Be, be, in the, be a student of the game. Go watch as much film as you can. Learn as much as you can. I can't do anything but help you. I'm the last one. People are constantly asking me, why is Miami down as a program? Right? I mean, and I'm not sure I can answer this question. Is it the fruits haven't been as good? Is it the culture wasn't great? But the next time somebody asks me that on TV, what should I say? You know, I mean, that's I've, I've been over that probably a million times in my head. And what, what have you called it? What do you think it it's, really it's just a combination of just... You know, some 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 of the players that we had to get rid of were kind of cancerous to the team, and they really really brought us down. Didn't care about football. They're they're gone now, which is which is really really good for us. Which we can get back to focusing on football. And sometimes the coaches are more worried about punishing the guys that weren't doing good more than focusing on football, which really took it away from what we needed to get done. You know, we we try not to think. We did try not to bring back last year too much. I mean, that we need to move on and get past that. But I mean, the, you can't help but think about it, and it's always in the back of your mind. And I mean, Virginia is probably going to get. We're, pro we're going to probably bring it against Virginia next year, but. but uh, no, it, it definitely hurts, and we, we definitely use that in, in, in the weight room and use that as motivation, and we definitely don't want to repeat what we did last year. So it's great. You know, I mean, we got, I mean, everybody, a lot of people have the wrong impression about this, this conference as being, it doesn't have those, I, I don't want to say that, but I, I was asked a little bit earlier, it doesn't have those championship contenders, it's just, people don't realize the amount of competition at every game, even, even when we play, I, mean, I don't want to mention any teams, but a team that you wouldn't think is very competitive. All, I mean, all of our games are always closer than most people would think. I mean, this is a very competitive conference, which makes it hard to, to win every game. But we, uh, all, all, all it's going to come down to is, uh, you know, working hard, whoever prepares the most, and uh, obviously executing on the field. You guys practiced at Dolphin Stadium? Haven't been there. I, I assume we're going to be to be there a lot during camp. You kind of get used to the. Uh, Atmosphere. Have you ever attended a Dolphins game? I've attended a Dolphins game and I've been to, uh, I've, I've watched high school championships there and Marlins games. I've been to the stadium a fair amount of times, but I've never actually practiced there. How do you think the environment will compare to the Orange Bowl? You know, I think I think uh, a lot of the diehard fans are going to are going to miss the Orange Bowl just because of all the history. But I, I know I know the facilities are a lot nicer. I know a lot of the people that just want to go there and watch watch Miami. Maybe not the uh, diehard fans that have been watching for 20, 30 years, but maybe, I'm sure they'll they'll like the uh, facilities that are on the stadium. Are your classmates going to be able to get from Coral Gables to? I'm not exactly sure how, but I've, I don't know, and I've heard talk about uh, buses and uh, free, free, free transportation over to the game, so I, I know that's going to help out a lot. perception Why do you think that perception exists? You know what, I, I, I don't have a good answer for you there. I mean, it's just, I guess that's just the way people think of it. I mean, uh, we've had a couple of down years in the past, and so have other other couple of traditional big name schools in the ACC, which is that's probably probably the main reason. It is, I would say it's very important. We we definitely. I mean, I'm not. I'm worried about us winning for more important reasons than how the conference looks. But I mean, I, I think that definitely has a lot to do with it. Um, given all you said, how, how, 
worried are you that so much is being placed on these young freshmen? You know, I'm not worried at all from what I've seen of them. I mean, I know they're freshmen, I know they're young, and they're going to make mistakes, but everybody makes mistakes. I, from what I've seen of them, I, and as much talent as we have, and all, all uh, four of the quarterbacks, and we just signed, I don't even know how many receivers, a ton of receivers, and, and they're making a lot of plays during 7-7, seven and, seven, and I know, it, I mean, if all of them don't play, which I know a good handful of them will, and, yeah. and I know a handful of them will make a lot of big plays for us as well. How did so many of those freshmen report early in the spring? How much does that help? Well, that's that's what definitely you a lot. I mean, with guys like Jacory and Cannon, I know that helped them learn. I mean, quarterbacks are a hard position to learn. You kind of have to know what everybody's doing. You have to uh, kind of be the director out there and get everybody get everybody lined up. And, I mean, coming in in the summer, you only get that month, two months, month frame before camp to learn it. So it's really hard on, on an 18-year-old, which I, I know that. You started as a true freshman or as a red shirt? Yeah, I forget. True freshman. But, just what's the biggest part of that adjustment process where you're going from straight from high school to the starting line? It's just, it, there's so many, the game gets so much quicker, and especially at quarterback when you're facing athletes in this conference, it's, uh, you're, it's, a, it's a whole different level, which, I mean, that, their extra time here will, will be anything but helpful. You, you, hear, you hear that all the time, and it, it, you know, losing games hurts enough. You don't need to hear people always in your face about